penultimate day of racing here, incredibly tight at the top. It's going to be all to play for today and tomorrow to decide who's going to win the Royal Cup. There's going to be a little bit of waiting until the breeze settles in. Meanwhile, at the top of the table for the season title, it's all square between Quantum Racing and Phoenix. Tom Slingsby and Terry Hutchison, both from American Magic. The Phoenix team is really well sailed and yeah, they don't make a lot of mistakes. It's one of the few boats in the fleet that possesses the ability to round the top mark in sixth or seventh and turn it into a third. It's great that we're so close and racing, we're all tied up at the moment. It's pretty cool, but uh, we've got a lot of racing to go and sled are starting to eat away into our lead, so the two horse race might turn into a three horse race soon. What are we talking about at the end in Barcelona? Who's going to be on top of the, uh, top of the standings? I guess I've got to say my boss is probably going to be Terry. <laughs> he is the boss. He is the boss. Yeah, I've got to be a little careful no, sometimes no, out there. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, that's not the truth, actually. I'm going for him just as hard as anyone. So race seven starts in a building breeze. It's only eight or nine knots on the start line. 1.7 mile beat. Quantum Racing lead uh, up the early part of the beat and get round ahead and build a big lead down the first run. Platoon get through them to lead through the leeward gate. But there's a big shift or an increase in pressure on the right side of the course, which is recognized by Prevetsa coming up the second beat. So they lead round the top turn and through the finish line. Prevetsa winning. Platoon get through in second. Allegra third and Sled in fourth. So Platoon go 2-1-2 two, two over the last three races and sled extend their lead to six points at the top of the table. So the second race of the day, the breeze is around about 15 knots but fading over the course of the race. Quantum Racing have a big lead uh, all the way around the first beat and down through the first uh, lure gate. Vayu get back in the second beat and get up to second but Sled lose out in the shifty conditions and drop to sixth. So Quantum Racing finally seal a race win, their first here in Scarlino. Vayu get second but down in sixth then Sled still lead into the final day by a single point. I think if you saw the results, it was a pretty tough day. We fought back a couple of times and then uh, dropped back a couple of times. But, um, you know, we have to take the positives away from the day and we made some good moves. And I'm a little bit angry about the first race because we deserve better than that. But, I mean, it's nice to get smacked in the teeth and then come back and follow it up with a win. The sled's beaten us by a point, but the goal was always to go into the last day of racing with an opportunity to win the regatta, and we've done that. And so tomorrow it's up to us. So leaders of the Royal Cup are Sled with 27 points going into the final day. Second are Quantum Racing on 28, third are Phoenix on 31. So big Saturday showdown here in Scarlino in prospect. Sled leading by a single point from Quantum Racing on one of the most challenging race courses of the season.